70 years ago on October 14, 1947, the X-1 rocket aircraft made history with a first supersonic flight. Traveling around 700 miles an hour, the X-1 was faster than the speed of sound. Piloted by United States Air Force test pilot Chuck Yeager, the X-1 was nicknamed Glamorous Glennis for Yeager's wife. Built solely for experimental purposes, the X-1 established research aircraft. X-planes are experimental aircraft used to test new aerodynamic concepts and technologies. Ready to launch five, four, three, two, one. Uh, that's a good life, that's a good life. Push your throttle up. Igniter, ready to launch now. 50 years ago, on October 3rd, 1967, the X-15 rocket aircraft set a new speed record. Flying at Mach 6.7, or 4,520 miles per hour, William J. Pete Knight piloted this record-breaking flight. Flying faster and higher than ever before, pilots qualified as astronauts reaching the edge of outer space, as high as 50 miles into the atmosphere. To push the envelope, NASA pioneered new technologies, engines, and materials. NASA is building on that legacy of experimental aircraft today. A new X-plane called the Low Boom Flight Demonstrator, or LBFD, is being developed to minimize sonic booms. A sonic boom is made by shock waves when an aircraft travels through the air faster than the speed of sound. Current noise regulations restrict supersonic flights over land. Unique shaping and other design features will diminish the loud sonic boom to the level of a soft thump. Another new NASA X-plane is electric and battery powered. The X-57 is testing new propulsion technology. Twelve motors provide extra lift during the takeoff, and then two cruise motors take over. Distributing energy over the entire wing makes the X-57 more efficient. Flying above and beyond, NASA continues to push the envelope in aerodynamic research.